Good evening, welcome. I'm Destiny of a Dragon Warrior, and we have ourselves a standard flag set Dragon Warrior randomizer race. Looks like just one on one between Hoodie Two Shoes and I. Welcome, Wander Down. Thanks for the good luck. Hey, it's all Bianca. Welcome. Hope you're having a good evening. Six eight one nine eight two. Oh, we've got a third. American Dweem is going to join. Fantastic. We'll have a three player race. Welcome, Mr. Sporting Chap. Thanks for the good luck. Appreciate it. Hope you're having a good evening. Good Tuesday. Squeezing in a early, little bit earlier standard race. Hoodie Two Shoes open up the room. See if there's any takers. And normally I am not ready to go quite this early in the evening, but it happened to work out today. So, gonna play through the race here, and then afterwards I'll probably get in some Tecmo Super Bowl one-on-one -on -one online games for the leagues that I'm involved in. Mm -mm -mm. See, see if I can redeem myself some from some pretty poor performance in Tecmo on Sunday. But I offset that with some pretty good performance on the Dragon Warrior Randomizer Standard Race on Sunday. And we've got a fourth diabetes. Fantastic. We'll have a bit, of, a bit of a race here going, huh? Very good. Ooh, manicure time for Bianca. Enjoy the pampering. <laughs> a little manicure. While watching the Dragon Lord get destroyed. Diabetes is ready. Dweem should be shortly. All right. The race room up on my mobile since I'm still having trouble connecting live split with race time. I haven't been able to resolve the issue where it doesn't allow the pop up with Microsoft Edge. <laughs> yeah, Lee, leagues, Lee, leagues. <laughs> 40th birthday on Monday. Oh, happy birthday, Bianca. Oh, 40's a big one. On Monday, a seed for me to try. Oh man! Well, we'll have to give that a whirl for your birthday. How how does that sound? On or around that Monday for ya? Hope hope you have a good one. I I was a bit stressed out going into my 40th birthday earlier this year, and then it's came and went, and I barely have a thought of like, oh yeah, I'm 40 now. <laughs> The chase was more stressful than the catch. <laughs> just like agility, age is just a number, right? <laughs> mm -mm 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 -mm. We got a good luck have fun from the Dweemer. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And 
minute countdown in the race room. All right. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, go. So let's see if we start with extra keys. Feels like there's been a lot of seeds lately with the extra key. Ah! Ah! Told ya! Key gold. Nine strength. And hurt more. Um, Let's just keep our key and forget the treasury and go hurt more stuff. Uh, yeah, we're fine with the gold. But we should use the gold to get all the keys right away. Yeah, yeah. Let's do this. See what's in the basement. Looks like we might be near the northeast corner. Wasn't a town on screen. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, there's our six keys. Pop open the treasury. I'm not gonna bother with downstairs unless we get a torch. Ooh, gold in the lower right. <laughs> and the lower left, double gold. And the silver heart. And the stones of sunlight? Wow. Did music shuffle and got a decent one? Oh, cool. How was the uh, music shuffle that worked? That have some silly combinations? Some music out of place? <laughs> 7, 2, 1, 0, return. <gasps> Swamp North. It's so strange. Oh, I bet. I'll have to try that sometime. Oh, the spike is a golem. Okay, so it's not a hurt more enemy. That's what we wanted to check. Throw my controller on the floor. Anything to the south. down a drakey for level three. Oh, the hey the title screen music i didn't even think about that being part of a shuffle 6110 gross no spells a cave i want to burn my hurt more on this guy Or that guy, come on. Okay, Warlock for the level. <laughs> Four, six, two, zero. <laughs> two caves down here. It's Mountain Cave. Stone's Cave, one free cheddar chest. Spell, which accounts for one search. What? Okay, we'll die here. Not? I will die. We might not be in the northeast corner if it continues east. 
all the songs, the DL2, the fan end fanfare, the credits, every dungeon. Ah. Hop through Swamp Cave. Let's go through. Could back into Garenham. Could have a town nearby, one way or the other. Uh, yeah, we'll take out the Metal Scorpion. It's level 5. Two, two, eight. Hurt more out of that. It does back into Garenham. So we've got our first town. Three chests to check in here. <gasps> Erdrick Sword! Wow, we've got all the power. Torch. And some fairy. Okay. Lots of swamp. Let's check what's in the weapon shop. Silver shield is all we would gold for. Let's get a chain mail. Uh, uh, let's get herbs. We have a little bit of healing. Take a little bit of a walk around until we die. <laughs> That's cut off. Okay. He's got weak breath. Okay. <laughs> so that's where I am going with that, Bianca. Now I will check what's behind Tantagel. And if it's a cave, like, gr so Grave would be the only one back here that we could get a gold grind. In. Otherwise, uh, Mountain is to the south. I will want to explore that anyways. Pots tablet. Don't feel good about doing this. Here, got a key back. Then we have to walk all the way back around and out because we don't have outside. Waste of about 30 seconds. Should have just skipped this. Especially with three quest items already found. I should have been stubborn and skipped that. But now we know. Another Wraith for level 6, and then we still have one Hurt more left. Three, zero, zero, thirteen, and sleep. Well, that's two more. First. Green Dragon. Ambushed and we survived. We one-shot. Not on a 59. Okay.
gonna peek this. I haven't gone very far in this direction. I'm looking for a good hurt more zone. Warlock. Oh, these guys had weak breath, didn't they? I gotta be careful. HP is still really low at level 6. Axe Knight. Ah, oh, didn't quite get him. Probably will need to one-shot those guys with such low hit points. Yeah, because our, our max HP is only 29, and so is our max MP. Take an armor knight. That is a good overworld grind spot. Once we have enough HP to survive those kind of hits. Chests and mountain cave to initiate the group. Let's go for it. Yeah, I figured I should be able to one shot that guy with Airdrop Sword. Ooh, ambushed survived, can I one-shot him? No effect. <laughs> Death counter is a rise in Bianca, and there's one more. <laughs> we need more hit points. the east edge of the map, confirmed. Jew and Lord, those are good hurt more enemies right now. That's what we want. Listen with the rates. I'm gonna hurt more him so I can guarantee... Yeah. Then we'll use some herbs to heal up. We get a healing spell here at level 7. Zero, one, two, one, outside. So we started with hurt more. Haven't gotten any help since. Oh, stop spell two. experience will be the next level. There's a stop spell. Neighbor! Good evening! Welcome! 
No shield so far, but there's a good probability that we will be gold grinding for a silver shield. Short. We started with Hurtmore. We found Erdrick's sword very early. That's about all that we've been able to accomplish. But that's a lot to accomplish in, in the first 15 minutes. Hurt more and the sword. One more decent enemy. Be the next level. Spell is blocked. We'll chop him down. We're hoping for hit points. Hit points have been very low. Need that to be able to use our hurt mores on axe knights and armor knights and the green dragons that we've seen so far. 0685. That's a little more help. Oh, definitely, neighbor. Like, the sword, it, it's cool, we found it and everything, but we already have hurt more, so... I would definitely have preferred Erdrick's armor. You got that right. Especially with all the swamp tiles, like... <laughs> this little corner of the map. Big swamp must have gotten triggered on. <laughs> Trying to peek down a little bit further in case there's a town or a take a death. Let's have heal. I guess I could have put him to sleep. Yeah, let's sleep him. Sleep him and hit him. <laughs> First turn wake up. He didn't heal though. Use another... Yeah, I'll use another herb. This is not very efficient with Hurt. Once I kind of started walking, you just gotta continue, right? We were clearing a fair piece of the map. There's Sharlock. Sharlock is basically due south from home. East Edge again. Ivern's! Those are... Great hurt more enemies. Okay, send us home, Axe Knight. Very good. Job well done. <clears throat> now we need we want to survive enough in Mountain Cave. To open up two chests and initiate the gold grind. We tried Mountain Cave once and we died. <laughs> There's knights here. They're like the best hurt more enemy for this stage of the game besides uh, Magiwite. Stay here and try to take another knight. That is unfortunate that we've seen all the other enemies except knights. And through here several times. That Wraith gets us exactly level 9. 10 to 12 to, so 12 more hit points is helpful. Yeah, it's not a great trade-off on the Wraiths. But we don't want to take... We don't have a healing spell, and we don't have HP. So it's better to just use up our Hurt Mores on these guys. This is the enemy we really want. Guaranteed down in one Hurt More. With 78 experience. Hey, <laughs> go search that Night Tile. <laughs> No treasure guards. Standard flag set tonight. Herb. Nice 
Alright, now we're getting the knights. We'll have one more hurt more after this. There's our last knight. Take a shot at Mountain Cave. I don't expect this to work, but we're here. at chest one. Go. It's an herb. Okay, second floor. Okay, we've opened up the second chest. The gold glitch will be initiated. Second curse belt. Know there are search spots occupied that we will want to see. Gold. Death necklace. Now we want to take a death, so I'm not going to be able to bonk around to that last chest. Okay. It gets us halfway there. We might be able to beat this Wraith, otherwise he'll take us down and that's perfectly fine. Oh, we got him. Close to the level. Condition runs. Okay, this wraith should do it. Unless he casts stop spell, which he did. We'll be close to the level. Now if we get a... Oh, a magician would get us one experience away. There's a wraith. We stop spells, so we'll, we'll get the level before we take the death. That works too. Maybe we'll get a healing spell out of all of that, huh? Nineteen power and twenty. <gasps> Look at that level. Wow. Come on. On a wraith or something that can kill us. Come on. Where are all the enemies now? Magician. That time to take the death. So now we've initiated the gold glitch, the chest glitch. There's gold in the lower chest, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oops. Eight. Now this chest is glitched.
Look at all the extra HP now. Now we have 89 HP. I'll take a little extra gold over the 15,000 for the silver shield in case we get to another town. Then we can also get gold plate potentially. Oh, I'm not going to do that, Bianca. I think one of them is a cursed belt and the other one... Well, no, I can't because it's the harp and the stones. There's nothing in there. <laughs> That's right! <laughs> yeah, we'll need we'll need to we'll need to grind radishes. Radish grind once we find Cantlin, right? <laughs> Can we get infinite radishes from the radish vendor? I'm gonna use my fairy water to reduce encounters along the way. We're gonna go through Swamp Cave, which will pop us back out into Garenham. Swamp Spike enemy is a golem that we're in no position to fight without a heal more. <laughs> That's right, only only six. That's true. <laughs> There's an inventory limit of six radishes, right? <laughs> Y'all are too much. Love it. a dragon scale yet. Let's take care of that. Get our silver shield. Here you go, Bianca. Here's your moment. Boom. Silver shield acquired. Still don't have a healing spell, so we're taking all kinds of damage walking through the swamp time. Now we're defense breaking the rings. our axe knights. <clears throat> really like a healing spell. I hang out here and take out axe knights for a level and get a healing spell, hopefully? I don't like that. Even if they ambush me. And don't go down in one shot. Yeah, we'll just do one herb for now. Werewolf is okay. shot him either. <laughs> oh, neighbor, don't bring on the torture. <laughs> you, know, you know exactly what we don't want. <laughs> I might not one-shot this guy. Ah, but he didn't take me down. <clears throat> Even if we take a death, it's not tragedy because there's a similar zone near Tantagel to grind with Axe Knights. <laughs> it's free torture! 
I don't think I one shot any of these Axe Knights. This one's just shy of the level. We're out of herbs. Hopefully we one shot the next guy. Ugh. Ambush is the opposite of what we do. Gotta one shot him here. And we do on a good 65. That's a max hurt more. Level 11. 13, 8, 0, 3. No healing spell. Well, neighbor, we're on the path. <laughs> we're on the path to a level 13 heal. Take out one more enemy. Take a death. Go back, explore the main continent. Or, I guess we can do a little more walking here. And Green Dragon will send us home. <laughs> Would have sent us home if we didn't get the crit. Perfectly timed crit. That was a useful crit. We don't see useful crits very often. <gasps> There's a town and we're still alive. If it's not Hawksus, we get the heal. Reconary. We'll take it. Do we have better armor here? We sure do. Full plate. Perfect. Look at how that ended up. We survived. We just barely got into town. Three hit points left out of herbs. So we're coming here, stocking up on herbs. Two, three, four, five. <laughs> no radishes here. Reconary is a radish free zone. <laughs> Spend an evening at the Motel 6. I should start mapping the second continent. Baron and South. is up there so plates curious to see if this this does connect so this is all right there by home okay one continent confirmed Trying to Axe Knights until we get a healing spell? We're almost at level 12. Let's just get level 12. I did leave one chest behind in Mountain Cave. He did not forget that, but with two cursed belts, that's two search spots. I'm not going to go back to Mountain Cave. We'll save, we'll just have to remember that at the end if we're running out of spots to check. Still have the last chest in there. L back on. Even heal, instead of heal more, would be very helpful. And to be relying on cards. Alright, level 12. Four, four, nineteen, five. Still no healing spell. Eh? Hey? 
map is very elongated. <laughs> this took us down by Sherlock. That's piece of land of nothing. Sure is. <laughs> I'll give you credit though. I'll take level 13 rather than level 16, neighbor. <laughs> I'm gonna probably pop back and stay in Garenham. Just take a death. I can take a death at any time. Yeah, we'll do that. We don't need gold for anything. We'll keep walking until we take a death. We'll be right here on the armored knight unless we get an excellent move. Excellent move! We're getting the crits all at the right time. survive that we might be able to swing him down no not quite okay hmm. um let's cut through swamp cave and get back by garenham and explore west We've seen, feels like we've seen a lot of the map, but there's a lot of locations we have yet to see. <laughs> yeah, you sure have. I think last night there was no crits, if I remember correctly. Now we've had a couple of very well-timed crits so far. You're lucky to get one useful crit in a seed. We've had at least two. Been west at all, except to see that that spot. Push my green dragon. How many herbs do we have? Should I talk about herbs before we go walking? Got four left after that one. Okay, we can go over that bridge. <coughs> Hit a level. I'm gonna go back to Garenham, get the level, stock up on herbs. Hopefully, we'll get a healing spell. Is this still the green dragon zone? Yep. Level 13. Four, one, eleven, twenty-seven, and heal more. Neighbor, you nailed it. Heal more at level 13. enough. Now we have... We're almost at ghost stats, aren't we? Yeah, we're pretty darn close. Just need a little bit more of every stat. We've got heal more. We haven't seen either trade in cave. We need the token and Erdrick's arm. So let's now go south and go west across that bridge we saw.
just a little sliver of the map. Okay, nothing over here. So we haven't gone north. Let's go north. Do more swap tunnels. Ha, this does not dead end. But it just loops around. It's just a little late. Okay. little single tile path. Top of the map. Probably not much land up here. We'll check it out. Yep, nothing up here. Take some more axe lights while we're here. We haven't seen Cantlin, Remolder, or Cole, or Hawksness. That's four towns outstanding. Yeah, because we've only seen Garenham and Breckenary. That goes nowhere. Here's a town. Which one are you going to be? Let's check coordinates. Keep an eye on my key count. How many keys do we have? Three, so I'll buy keys before I leave. And stay at the inn. See what kind of coordinates we're dealing with. Oh, no coordinates. So the information we have on the two cursed belts is coal and hawksness. Let's fill up on keys. Stay at the inn. Get radishes. There's our radishes. Yay. Okay, so Colin Hawksness. We still also haven't seen Grave. <coughs> okay. This is the path we went before. Red dragons, we can take red dragons now. We can take red dragons now. We need to use a heal more mid battle. That's okay. 350 experience? This is great. Some land to the south.
We have both trade-in caves and grave that we haven't seen. And three towns. Old Hoxus and Remolder. A lot of stuff we haven't seen or having covered as much as the map as it feels like. This doesn't seem familiar. Ah! Got a cave! The harp traded, so we right ordered that before finding the rainbow top cave. Okay? trade in cave down here. Mine on HP. Almost at level 14. So we're gonna be over leveled before we find everything we need. There's a town. There's a red. We've got the level here before hitting the town. Hopefully it's a healing town. We'll, we'll still have enough MP to do something in boxes. A heal. Level 14. 2, 7, 15, 9. Remolder. Keys! <laughs> Open up, get the treasure chest, stay at the end. Being useful as expected. We are on a mission for Cole and Hawks. Last two towns. cave we have outstanding. We'll check the top three chests, but based on curse belt and item knowledge, we are not going to be dying. Porch. Key. And go. Okay. That's outside. Cave is up there. Another town. This is either Cole or Hawksness. It's Hawksness. We've got full resources. Let's see what's going on here. Red Dragon, no problem. I don't think I sit here and grind for a level. Ooh, Erdrick's token. So. 50, there, there is an item in coal. 50-50 chance it's the armor. Otherwise, it's the flute. <clears throat> so we need to find coal. 
fight stuff like this along the way. Here's another cave. This is gonna be our rainbow drop trading cave. Perfect, perfect routing, okay. Rainbow drop acquired. We are on a hunt for coal. Going to be the west edge of the map. Probably coming up. Swinging back this way. Loop. So if armor is not in coal, then we have Deep Brave and Charlotte. Need to go. No, we can't get across there. Okay. Feels like we're <clears throat> going on a wild goose chase for coal, and it's gonna have the flu. Kind of like on Sunday when the coordinates had the flute, and it was just fluted armor outstanding. It's a very similar situation. And we have grave outstanding. Very similar situation. There was grave. Dave was on the way back by running. Huh. Two hurt moors with no effect on this time. Um. Comes a point where I will return home or take a death. Yeah, coal is not out here. I did not full explore. Past Charlotte. Let's do it. Let's take a death. We got everything we needed over there. So now we can explore by Sherlock for coal and potentially do I because let's see. Yeah, we're at we're at go. We'll get another level just fighting stuff along. We are at go stats with nothing else. We did have that last chest in mountain. Let's clear that. It will be sad if we left armor behind this whole time. Odds are it's not in here, but we're walking past it anyways. We'll do a quick peek. Right to the last chest. Cast outside and get out of here quickly. This is only going to take a minute or less. And it's gold. Okay. Now we know.
Crowlock was down here. We'll get level 15 and then we're done leveling. Hopefully get some more agility so it's easier to run from stuff. Fighting it. Red Dragon will get us awfully close. Forty-three experience away. The wolf will do it. <laughs> Dodging. Fine. Eat a hurt more. Level fifteen. Three, seven, eight, five. More of everything that we don't need. We are looking for coal. A Sherlock. Nothing behind Sherlock. Nothing's over there. Check west for Like we did cross this. We're down there. Is this is this coal? No, that's Remalder. Hmm. So now here's the question. We know 50-50 armor is in... I have graves since I'm here. I just made a decision. Doing all the wrong things, it feels like. I guess if we happen to find the flute down here, that will tell us 100% that armor is in coal. If we don't, then we could take a chance on Sherlock instead of wandering the map further from Or the armor could be down here, and then we're done. Four. Megan scale. to the bottom. Let's run from the red. And chest five. Well, oh, after we get past this red dragon. Nothing. Okay. <clears throat> it's landlocked. Didn't walk along the south coast entirely down. 
Yeah, we did. That's where we came from. Nothing over there. I feel like we full cleared there. Unless it's somewhere by Brackenary. Okay, we're, we're gonna count on Charlotte. I, I can't. I'm not gonna wander the map for coal. We're gonna count on armor and Charlotte. Got 11 heal mores. Little bit of a cushion. Oh, fairy water. Right, so coal is trick is coal we know has either the armor or the fairy. 50 50, either one. We know it definitely has an item. Other than coal, which we have no idea where it is, I only have a hunch of a few small corners of the map that may have not fully cleared. I'm going to take a chance on Charlock. That feels bad. Take a chance on Charlock. I'm betting on the 50 50 that armor is in Charlock. Because I know where Charlock is, and I have no idea where. So I either take the 50-50 chance on Charlock, or I wander the map, which could take one minute or <laughs> 20 minutes. Guaranteed to not do this in one dive. Down to nine heal mores. Our attack power is going to be good using the death. Pack. I'm not going to get any. before we worry about all. So I have to burn another heal more. This is likely a two die. Even if armor is down here. More herbs anyways. We can do all that. Let's see what the odds of this. I mean, we're defense breaking Star Wars. <laughs> Can't run from them. So attack power is going to be 139. So my average attack is going to be about 18. Ugh. Eight heal mores. Good rolls. Let's see if this is going to be the same story as Sunday. This time we're not leaving behind Deep Grave, we're leaving behind a 50 50 and coal. So my odds of this being the right move are less than what I had on Sunday.
basement three. The walk to Sharlock was more difficult than the walk in Sharlock with all those red dragons. Armored Knights. Basement four. I'm gonna do Judge's Table first, so I don't need to use Radiant or Count on a Torch in the Treasury if I have to come back up with the Judge's Table. This is not normally what I do. Not gonna feel good when it's totally not the armor. But because I'm relying on a single Torch, I have no MP buffer for Radiant. Swings, yep, okay. Judge's table cleared. Run fails to dragon. Herb. Okay, down to the bottom. Down the U. Cross the straightaway. Ambushed by a golem. We're in the basement. Show us Erdrick's armor. Herb. Fighter's ring gives us two more attack power. Forgot about that. That helps. And there's Erdrick's armor. Um, I'm. Check the other chest for herbs. Yup, we got an herb. Don't need a torch. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's give this a shot. This is a low probability fight, but we're gonna go for it. We're down here, we've got eight heal mores. We'll have 141 attack power with death necklace. Good to average 15 uh, damage per swing on the Dragon Lord. If we get 11 swings in, oh man, this is this is gonna be very close. He <coughs> was still fighting this car. It's been almost a month. Come on, Armor Knight, be nice. Be nice. He was. He let us live, but he was not nice. About it. Gotta hope for a friendly spike top. Second golem that's ambushed. It's... Oh, a wizard ambush. What the heck? Dragon, haven't seen a blue all seed. Oh, he's got hurt! That's good. Question is, how much do we. Ooh, he's got heal. I guess that's okay, we won't be taking damage. 
question is how much heal walking do we do? Forty-two. I do it. This has a low probability of working, but we're gonna go for it. I might go well. So Emerging like eleven. I got a I got a death necklace. <sighs> Stop spell. We've, we've got to count on good rolls. Mod of herbs, right? Yep, a mod of herbs. Okay, no back attack. I'm gonna go for it. We're gonna go for it. We gotta swing on 47. 29. We're alive. It worked. We need a good heal more here. Got a good heal more. 39. Low roll. could have gotten another double. One oh nine, I've got a heal more. And then we've gotta do give the hurt more a shot. One in sixteen chance. Doesn't work. Okay. We tried. But we got the armor, we didn't wander the map for coal. We're gonna head right back and finish this off. We're cursed, it's fine. Your pal will be able to heal up in Breconary. There you go, neighbor! The in-laws kicked us out. Just let me get into Breconary. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Our max HP at this point. Still 89, so we're gonna buy a torch. No, we got an X second to torch, didn't we? I I gave it up. Okay. Six herbs. We're gonna have to sell something. Ah. Should have used the wings when I got out. Four, five, six, don't need the torch, we should have enough MP, but I just don't want anything to go wrong and ways to heal more for no good reason to not buy it. Two MP exactly for repel as we leave Reconary. Go finish this off. So we had the good luck of being able to finish a single armor. Dragon Lord finished dive. 
on Sunday. Unable to do it tonight. Just lost one too many heal mores at least. Our swings were not good either. We did not get or got a couple of doubles. Manufactured a double. Swing on that 47 in the onset. One red dragon along the way this time. Three front blocks. Dude. So not nice. This is so not nice. I guess at least there before we get into the dive, I suppose. Ugh. I have any fairy water, so I'm gonna use it. Don't have it. Okay. Sherlock, take two. This time we don't need to check every nook and cranny for the armor. We have the armor. Never found coal. Sorry, coal. Your flute will remain as it belongs. How a run fails to golems and sharp. Big difference this time is we have the benefit of heal walking with Erdrick's armor. Jeez, ambushed by a werewolf, too. less HP because we're cursed with the death necklace, so we're stuck at that 107 hit points. Down the U. The Armor Knight. Pushed by an Armor Knight. Straight away. We're in the basement. Knight, we'll take that. This time we're coming into the Dragon Lord fight. Ten heal mores. Opposed to eight. That's a big difference. If we get a, even a little bit luckier on the swings, this will be no problem. And it looks like we're gonna fourth place finish. Diabetes finished in first. About 15 minutes ago. Way to go, Diabetes. And then Dweem and Hoodie just finished. Here we go. Thou art a fool. Should bring him down. Here we go. Don't need to waste time on any herbs. Let's wreck this dragon lord. And we don't get back attack. And we start with a 20. And we get an opening. Already at 38.
54. Sixty-six. Eighty-five. Rolls are coming in this time. One hundred on the button. Sixteen one thirty one forty three. Get him on two swings here. Seeing with two heal mores. Ooh, 153. And we easily cover the spread. With, uh. If I would have gotten those swings, that exact same battle, first time around, I would have been able to finish because I came into the second one with two extra heal mores, and I finished with two heal mores remaining. So I would have finished my first fight on my last swing. One hour, 22 minutes, 34 seconds. Almost one, two, three, four. One, two, two, three, four. The early hurt, hurt more, and sword and stones and harp were interesting. The map gave me a lot of trouble, especially like going through Swamp Cave and popping out Garenham, and then it becomes one continent and kind of trying to piece it all together. Never found coal, so very fortunate that armor was not in coal, because I'd still be looking for it. <laughs> Thanks for the GG's, Bianca. American Dween, second place tonight, bud. GG's to you. Yeah, I changed the settings in uh, my browser with the randomizer to go through the original credits. It did that when I reset some settings with Microsoft Edge trying to fix my live split, and I just never bothered to change it back. Got sent home by Reds on the first dive. Oh! I tried a single dive for armor and finish like I did on Sunday. I got to the Dragon Lord with eight heal mores remaining. I squeezed out, I think, two doubles, but my rolls were just terrible. I wasn't able to finish. Then, the second dive. I finished with two heal mores remaining, but I went into it with two extra heal mores. So if I would have gotten the same rolls on my first Dragon Lord fight as I did on my second one, I would have been second place. You won on the last swing? Wow. Yeah, get the higher attack power. There's volatility in the swings. You were on in pace ahead of diabetes. Holy cow, and full cleared? Dude, you crushed it! Booty two shoes, GG's! Wandered the whole map two to three times because I couldn't find the harp trade in. Oh man! I stumbled upon the um, harp trade in. Like, my map is just garbage. It's all smushed together. Um. Oh, well, level 15, so just, yeah, so you're not even fighting enemies and, like, grinding along the way. That's the worst when you have a jetty seed like that, but then you're stuck exploring and trying to find something. I found everything except coal. I never found coal. I was down, I knew because of Curse Belt information that, um, 
coal there was something in coal and it was either armor or flute and i was like well i can either dive sharlock and take the 50 50 chance on armor being in sharlock or i can wander the map for coal and find it in two minutes or 20 minutes i banked on sharlock it ended up working out if armor wasn't in sharlock i'd probably still be right now wandering to find coal artorius thanks for the resub imagine getting an hour 22 on that seed 110 32 for you playing it async <clears throat> Well done. Too many distractions and you still did it in an hour and ten. <laughs> ah. Got screwed on your armor dive. Yeah, <laughs> Pixar, it didn't happen. I'm I'm with Dweem. I don't know if I can trust the Artorias. <laughs> well done, bud. It took me a little bit to find a good early grind with Hurtmore because HP was so low. It's all, it feels like a repeat of what I was describing on the Sundays seek. Early Hurtmore, HP was low. Took a little bit to find a good grind. Map was kind of funky. This one. Show you my map here if I can get this one. There. Everything down here is just Smush City. The Harp Trading Cave kind of went on a little dip off of the map. This ends up connecting over to Sharlock. Never found coal. I went through Swamp Cave and uh, hopped out of Garenham as my video freezes over there. So we'll refresh that. I'm back. I went through Swamp Cave, popped out Garenham, and then was walking east and I stumbled upon Breconary. I'm like, okay, cool, a healing town, healed up. Kept on walking east and then found Tantajo. And I was like, oh, one continent. So that was a super inefficient walk because I missed Cantlin to the north. I missed everything in the southwest corner of the map. Cole was eastern edge of the map due east of Mountain's Stone. Oh, you you mean like <laughs> right on the edge of the map that I have marked off that I cleared that I apparently didn't clear? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, Dweem saw coal. How did I not see coal that close to home? That's... No. We're gonna, we're gonna see coal. Hoodie didn't see it until way later. Okay. That makes me feel a little better, Hoodie. <laughs> so we're walking along. So there's Mountain Cave. There's the east edge of the map. Is it in the corner of all the- Oh, I was like out here and I was like, oh, that's going to be the coat. Yeah, see? Oh, I should have just walked right there and I would have seen it. I probably went more south. <laughs> yeah. Somehow I missed that. 
and we're dead. <laughs> oh, little swamp tiles. Right outside of Cole's and S tier zone. I think I did stumble into that zone. Knights, Axe Knights. Oh no, I did not see that zone. I saw Knights around Mountain Cave. But it took me a while going through that area a couple of times. I knew there were wraiths and like Agidrakis, I think, or something stupid there. I didn't see Knights for a long time. And then when I finally did, I was like, oh no. There was also by up in the north little peninsula by Swamp Cave. There was our Axe Knights and Armor Knights that I saw early in the seed, but it was when HP was too low to be able to survive. Yeah, greens were everywhere. I didn't see a blue dragon until the Sharlock Spike. Golem was the uh, Swamp Spike enemy if no one checked it. saw two golems in Sharlock. I saw like a dozen golems in Sharlock and they all ambushed me and I couldn't run from them and then I had wizards ambushing me. <laughs> I, I survived enough but agility was just a number. Slept. Oh they had sleep. Now I feel unlucky, but lucky at the same time because of the number of am ambushes that I got and run fails, but I never saw sleep. And here comes EMP with the raid. Welcome EMP and friends. Hey Sayaka, welcome. Hope you're having a good evening. EMP, how were your, uh, how were your seeds tonight? We just finished a four player race. I took fourth place. Diabetes took first. Dweem was second and Hoodie was third. Early hurt more. Oh, MP at level six. Oh, so you had hurt more but couldn't do anything with it. At worky but doing good. Good to hear it. Thanks for coming in with the raid, Sayaka. I appreciate it. Yeah. Level one hurt more. Low HP and MP for a handful of, uh, handful of levels. And then, what was it, like level 10 or level 11, we got double digits of every stat. That was pretty cool. One of the, yeah, one of the, <laughs> did Jeff roll the seed? No, empty I did. <laughs> yeah, we had the same thing. The first levels were like two, one, one, zero, and then like 
four two zero zero. We may have the damnedest time trying to buy herbs. Woody walked all the way to Garenham, looking for the harp trade in. Oh, so you, yeah, you missed a little dip down underneath and you were way on the west coast. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, one, one continent. Like, there's a big empty space kind of between, like, Breconary and Sherlock are on the east. And then Ramalder is on the west. Like, and then in between is a big empty space that would probably be... Correct, Artorius. Yep. Like, you can walk from Breconary and go west and kind of run into the Harp Trade-In. And if you go southwest, you'll hit Ramald and then that whole southwest corner of the map. If you go to Sharlock and then walk west along the south coast, you'll hit Ramalder. Here, some of some of the dips and twists aren't entirely accurate. Refresh my mug there. There's the map. Kind of. <laughs> like th this is more th this is all on the south coast, so like drop this down. There's like an open space between Reconary and Remolder and, and Harp Traded and all that. I walked due east. I popped out of Garenham and then walked east basically and found Breconary. And then from Breconary, I made it back home. And that's how I figured out it was one continent. <laughs> <laughs> Artorius put a beat destiny in the race room. You weren't even in the race. You didn't beat nobody. <laughs> Sometimes you feel like a nut. Sometimes you don't. Got that right, neighbor. Yeah, this was rough. It was rough because I didn't realize right away that it was two continents. Yeah. I knew my map was all kind of wonky. And that's where I was afraid of going back and trying to figure out coal. Rose over there. Um, I didn't want to go back and figure out where coal was because of how weird the map, like the map itself was kind of weird, but then the way that I ended up drawing it like that because I didn't realize it was two continents. Like, I had to take two pieces and try to put them together. <laughs> and that's what I came up with. <laughs> yeah, Fluffy Tail. That was our starting point. <laughs> we, we live in the tip of the tail. <laughs> right, Hoodie? Yeah, Harp Trade and that was stuck all by itself. Um, when I found Cantlin, it was in my second trip around the world, and I was like, oh man, that's a bummer. I should have seen this the first time. But it ended up being no Cornet, so not so bad. 